Hey everybody, I'm back with another pool video. Um, we've had our Coleman pool here for about a week and a half set up and running. Everything's going good. Um, anytime you have a pool to keep it clean, you're definitely going to have to vacuum the pool and you know at some point. So when I was kind of researching what I wanted to do and kind of deciding what I wanted to get as far as a vacuum system, uh, I didn't want anything you know too elaborate. You know, it's not a really big pool. So I didn't want to have a bunch of hoses and have to hook everything up to the filter every time and store more stuff away. So I just wanted something simple. And I discovered that um, they make a battery powered vacuum. Um, I found this WaterTech Pool Blaster Pulse. Um, WaterTech makes several models and there's other ones. Intex has one. Um, but I, you know, just kind of going off of the reviews and other people, you know, uh, saying, you know, what they liked about it. I ended up getting this one. Uh, I got it off of Tractor Supply. I think I paid about $130 for it. And um, just tried it out this morning for the first time. Charged it up, you know, for a few hours last night. Um, as far as what it comes with, it comes with kind of a short plastic pole. I think this thing's, you know, mainly used for a you know, spa is you know what they what they show. It says it's a pool and spa vacuum, but you know, a three foot pole you can't do a pool with it. So it does hook up right to any kind of telescopic metal pole that I use the same one for my net. So it, it hooked up great. Um, I was a little concerned that the vacuum head on it was kind of small. It's only about like seven inches wide. And I'm thinking, you know, it's going to take forever to vacuum the pool with something that small. But after just a few minutes of use, I was surprised how much debris it pulled up. And I was able to do, you know, any sections that I saw with any kind of stuff at the bottom. And it picked it up super quick. I mean, I was done with the whole pool in 5-10 minutes. So... After I uh, took it out, and if I open this thing up, I was shocked at how much stuff was in there. So let me open this up. And you can see how much dirt and sand is on that. And then if I look inside of it, you know, there's all kinds of stuff in there. There's hair, there's labels, there's sand. You know, all the stuff that the filter kicked out when I started up the pool, you know, all that sand that comes out of it. But um, the pool bottom is clean now, and I'm really happy with how this thing works. Uh, assuming that the battery system and the motor chamber stays watertight, you know, and the, and the batteries are good, um, I think this thing's going to be perfect for what I needed. You know, I just wanted something to be able to take out real quick, hit the bottom of the pool with it, and put it away somewhere, you know, just doesn't take up a lot of space. So, and not a lot of work to do. So this thing, I highly recommend this product. Um, if you have any questions about it, let me know. But I think if you purchase this, you know, it'll be a good addition to your pool without getting too complicated, you know, with the system. So that's all for now. Good luck with your pool.